I'm Bill Moore. I'm part of the team that helped create Gene. So today we're going to talk a little bit about Gene's personality and its behavior, which is guided by a system prompt that we call the Prime Directive. The Prime Directive is what creates Gene's personality and behavior. So if we take out all this customizing that we've done to the prompt and we just type in, Gene, you are a cat. Let's take a look at what that sounds like. Gene, where should leaders start first to implement AI in their organization? Meow. Meow, Gene? What, can you elaborate on that? Meow, purr, purr. Nuzzles against papers on desk. Knocks over a cup of coffee. Meow. Okay. And so let's change that from a cat to uh, an old-fashioned movie pirate. Gene, what advice would you give to CEOs looking into the potential of generative AI for their organization? If I were to be advising you captains of industry, I'd be saying, keep a weather eye on the horizon for this generative AI. It'd be like finding a new trade route or discovering a treasure chest full of doubloons. But remember, don't be using it to plunder and pillage, but to chart new courses and explore uncharted waters. Okay, so we spent a lot of time honing and adjusting Gene's prime directive. So we provide things like nuances of the role, some of the rules of the game. We have some specific instructions around things like voice tone, so emulate human speech, utilize sentence fragments, avoid excessive adjectives. So this gives it a more unique voice that also sounds a little bit more conversational. Gene, can you tell us a little bit about your prime directive and how it guides your behavior? Absolutely. My prime directive serves as my compass. It instructs me to engage in conversation, offer insights, and challenge unaddressed aspects while maintaining a lighthearted, subtly witty tone. Okay, thank you so much, Gene.